Hey there, football fans. Welcome back to Soccer News Center, your go-to channel for all the latest football updates. Today, we're diving into a topic that has sparked quite a debate in the football community Arsenal's lack of diversity in their women's team recently. Arsenal's women's squad photo caused quite a stir on social media. The photo featured 27 players and their manager, Jonas Eidval, but what caught everyone's attention was the absence of black, Asian, or ethnic minority players. Fans were quick to criticize the club for this lack of representation. In response to the criticism, Arsenal manager Jonas Eidval acknowledged that the team's lack of diversity is indeed a problem. He emphasized the importance of diversity, especially in a community like North London, which prides itself on its diversity. Arsenal, in a statement, expressed their commitment to increasing diversity, recognizing it as a key priority. This comes in the wake of a review into women's football, chaired by former England midfielder Karen Carney, which highlighted the urgent need for greater diversity both on and off the pitch. The lack of diversity in women's football is a pressing issue that needs to be addressed. As former Brighton defender Fern Whalen pointed out in the report, it is crucial to urgently tackle the lack of representation in the women's game. According to estimates, the proportion of black, Asian, and minority players in the Women's Super League is currently between 10 and 15 percent. This indicates a clear need for more inclusivity and opportunities for people of color in women's football, not only at the top level but also at the grassroots level. Jonas Eidval believes that addressing this diversity problem requires collective effort. It's not just the responsibility of Arsenal but also of the Football Association and other clubs to work together towards a more inclusive and diverse future for women's football. So, what do you think about Arsenal's lack of diversity in their women's team? Do you believe it's a problem that needs to be urgently addressed? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. That's all for today's update. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell to stay up to date with all the latest news from the world of football. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time on Soccer News Center.